Now let's review some of the SDK features. The Solver SDK uses Windows facilities to create multiple threads of execution that can be run on different processor cores. If you have other compute intensive applications running at the same time as the Solver SDK, you can control the number of cores used separately for optimization and simulation using just one line of code. Solver SDK platform is fully reentrant and suitable for multi-threaded applications such as those on intranet, web server, or web service applications that are designed to serve multiple users concurrently. Let me show you that Solver SDK is available in platform and pro levels. The Solver SDK platform includes five bundle solver engines. The Solver SDK Pro includes four bundle solver engines. If your optimization problem is likely to exceed the size limits of the Solver SDK platform for the type of problem you want to solve, you can use our large scale solver engines. This feature is only available in SDK platform. The Solver SDK platform combines frontline systems' latest performance improvements in Solver engines with the speed of compiled programs. Speed gains are especially notable for nonlinear and non-smooth optimization problems. Solutions are often found 10 to 100 times faster. You can use the available examples as a starting point for your own application. The Solver SDK platform includes a comprehensive set of examples with complete source code that show you how to define and solve every type of optimization and simulation problem, from linear programming to efficient portfolio and simulation optimization. The example programs are usually installed in the following path. Let me show you how easily you can open and run each example in Visual Studio. Click on Open Project, browse to SDK Examples, choose your desired language, open a standard example folder, and then open this file. To run the examples, go to Debug, start debugging. Here you can select an example from a drop down list. Let's use the first one and run the example. Here are the results. And you can simultaneously see the source code for this example.